KFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, uh, Larry Pesavento, mid-afternoon update for TFNN. Folks, I put some pictures up here showing you what uh, the storm looked like here in Tucson yesterday. It was one of the worst, uh, one of the top five in the 130-some years they've been keeping weather records. But, boy, I'll tell you, it was a real real doozy here. We have a charbroil grill, double grill, and uh, that turned it over. I mean, that thing weighs several hundred pounds. Uh, the, the lawn furniture and stuff. They were it was thrown into the windows. You know, have these glass uh, sliding doors that are you know high grade that are supposed to be bullet not bulletproof but shatterproof. And uh, boy, it's amazing uh, what happened. I didn't have much damage, no water damage or anything, but not lost all electricity for a little over 15 hours. It finally came on at around oh I think just around four o'clock this morning for an hour, telling us that you had one hour to charge your phones and your oxygen <laughs> machines and then they'll be off for another few hours and uh, it was off for another half hour or so later and then they alerted us that uh, the lines were up and running so everything was okay so made it through okay we lost a bunch of trees in the neighborhood and stuff but uh, folks uh, this I'll tell you well you can see what the markets are doing 300 points up in the Dow Jones uh, 25 or 30 in the S&P uh, NASDAQ has come back to be up on the day after being down. Russell is up. Treasury bonds, treasury notes uh, basically unchanged. We got the U.S. dollar has strengthened, which was not a surprise to us because we've been watching for a potential high in that British pound up there at that 130, uh, 190 level, which has worked out pretty good. And also the fact that the euro has finally, maybe, finally, maybe, and we'll talk about it. Uh, made a top up in here. So just a lot of things uh, going on. Uh, one of the, uh, let's see if I get my clock right so I make sure I get this set. Shane Smolian will be our guest at the break. Uh, and one of the things I'm going to cover when we come back uh, from the break, which is in a few minutes, I, th I might be able to do it right now. One of the toughest things as a trader is to know when to set back and when to be careful because I have been through so much emotional stuff over the past 48 hours, so at least three days of emotional stuff that is just uh, truly, uh, it's uh, it's rocked my world, as they say in the trade. Anyway, I'll get back to that covered at the top of the hour. So live every day in an attitude of gratitude, and may God bless. And I please hope you'll stay with us for a trade what you see what's coming up in about three minutes. We'll be right back. 